Hello, today we're going to be learning how to make a potato battery. So what you need for a potato battery is a something made out of copper, like a penny, and something made out of zinc, and I use the galvanized nail. These are coated in zinc, which works too. And you'll also need some alligator clips to hook everything up. So we'll also light an LED up with this, and for an LED you need about three potatoes. And um, I tried using some potatoes that uh, smelled bad and were going bad, just because um, there's no point in wasting a good potato, right? Because you can't eat this after you've done it. So you'll start off by putting your galvanized nail into it, and put the copper penny into it. Get your alligator clips. Attach it to the. I'm going to attach it to the voltmeter first, just to show you how much we get out of it. And from this, we get about 0.7 volts, or 0.69. And so, around three or four of these should be able to light an LED. Now, to light an LED, you'll need to use more than one potato. So, I will continue to poke some more. Oh, it's falling apart, that potato. I'll use four potatoes, but you can also do it with three. That's when you'll probably first start to see it light. And so stick one galvanized nail and one penny into each potato. Then you can connect them in series. So zinc to copper. Then the zinc here. Nail to the copper of the penny. The zinc to the copper. You don't need this potato here. And finally, put one on the copper, which is free, and put this to one end of the LED. Get one from the other side and put it to the galvanized nail. Then if you connect it, you may connect it the wrong way at first, just because LEDs only go one way, so try it both ways. Oh, now we got some light. You see that. So that's just with four potatoes. Thanks for watching.